AI video generation just crossed the line and we're not going back. For months, every AI tool has made you compromise. Great visuals, but terrible audio. Decent motion, but zero control. High quality, but completely unpredictable results. Google's Veo 3.1 on Higgsville just changed that. Studio quality audio, full prompt control, realistic human motion, native 1080p HD output. I've tested every major AI video tool on the market, and this is the first time all four pieces actually work together, all in one platform. This is Veo 3.1, and it might just be the biggest leap forward AI video we've seen all year. You've heard of Midjourney, you know Pika Labs, maybe you've even experimented with AI video tools like Runway. But Higgsfield, this is one of the newest video generation tools making serious waves, and for good reason. It's not just that it's incredible at generating videos and images. What sets Higgsville apart is how accessible it is. The platform is built for creators, packed with templates that guide you through every step so you're never starting from scratch. But here's where it gets even better. Higgsville comes loaded with some of the best generation models available for both images and video, all built right into one platform. No jumping between tools, no messy workflows, everything you need in one place. But before I dive into Veo 3.1, let me quickly walk you through the Higgsville platform itself. At first glance, it might look a little overwhelming, but trust me, once you get the hang of it, it's incredibly easy to use. And if you want a full dive on Higgsville with all the features and workflows, let me know in the comments below and I'll create a dedicated video. Now, if you're already familiar with Higgsfield, I've got timestamps in the description. Feel free to skip ahead to the Veo 3.1 breakdown. But for everyone else, here's a quick rundown. Want to generate an image? Click the image button here. And if you click right here, you'll see all the AI models Higgsfield supports. Nano Banana, C Dream 4.0, Flux, GPT Image, and Wan. I'm gonna generate an image real quick. And now that's done, I'm gonna turn it into a video by clicking here. But before we generate the video, you can select the video model by selecting this drop down button here. Here we have Sora 2, which has been the talk of the town lately, Veo 3.1, Wan 2.5, Kling, and Minimax, all in one place. No switching platforms, no extra subscriptions. But of course, I'm going with Veo 3.1 for this one. And here's what it created. Now let's talk about the elephant in the room when it comes to AI video generation, audio. So what better way to test Veo 3.1's audio capabilities than by creating a full AI podcast experience? I started with this prompt to generate the base image. Once that was complete, I followed up with this second prompt to bring it to life with video and audio. Now, just a quick note, you don't actually need to write these paragraph long prompts for your generations. Higgsfield has a built-in prompt enhancement feature that does the heavy lifting for you. But I wanted to go manual here just to show you how incredibly well it follows detailed instructions. All right, here's the final result. And trust me, put your headphones on for this one. And this is the crucial part. When you look at the data, the connection between environment and output becomes incredibly clear. I thought it was past the point of being surprised by what AI can do, but this, this got me. Look, audio is 50% of the viewing experience, maybe more. You can have the most stunning visuals, the smoothest motion, the perfect composition. But if your audio is off, people scroll instantly. There's no free pass just because it's AI generated. Bad audio kills content, period. And what I just showed you, that's proof that AI video has finally caught up to that standard. I know I just showed you a detailed prompt, but this next one, I'm taking it up a notch. Here's the image I generated. And that level of detail, that's not just me showing off. Most AI video tools give you random outputs. You describe what you want and hope for the best, but you usually get something completely different. It's a gamble, not a workflow, but Veo 3.1 actually follows structured prompts, scene by scene, detail by detail. That means you can actually plan your content instead of generating 50 versions and praying one works. This is what separates a real production tool from just another AI experiment. Prompt control gives you consistency, repeatability, the ability to execute a creative vision, not just stumble into one. Now let's talk about the thing that separates good AI video from great AI video, realistic motion. Here's the problem. Most AI video tools can generate stunning visuals, but the moment you add motion, everything falls apart. Upload a reference photo and you get awkward robotic movement that screams AI generated. But Veo 3.1, it actually nails natural human motion. Check this out. The subtle head tilts, the natural hand gestures, the way her eyes move and her expressions shift. 
It's not just motion, it's believable motion, the kind you see in professional video content. Hello and welcome. In this episode, we're discussing how subtle shifts in your presentation style can significantly impact your professional presence. And this matters more than you might think, because without realistic motion, all the fancy audio sync and camera controls in the world won't save your video. It'll still look off. Veo 3.1 gets this right, and it's a massive deal. And here's the final piece that matters if you're creating content. Output quality. You can have the best motion, perfect audio sync, cinematic composition, but if your final export is a blurry compressed mess, none of this matters. Most AI video tools caps you at 480p, maybe 720 if you're lucky. And for YouTube and Instagram or TikTok, that's not gonna cut it. Veo 3.1 exports natively in full 1080p HD. Clean, sharp, actually usable. But here's what really makes this powerful for content creators. It supports multi-scene generation. You can get multiple cuts in an eight second clip, perfect for dynamic reels, shorts, or TikToks without having to stitch anything together manually. This is nearly production ready content. No post-processing, no quality loss. Just export and upload. Here's the reality. Every AI tool up to now has made you choose. Great visuals, prepare for robotic motion. Solid audio, say goodbye to control. High quality output, Hope you've got time to wait. But Veo 3.1 changes everything. And Higgsville is the platform that puts it all in your hands. Realistic motion, studio quality audio, full creative control, 1080p HD output, multi-scene generation, all powered by Veo 3.1's breakthrough technology. This isn't just another incremental update. This is the moment AI video actually becomes better and faster than traditional production workflows. The compromise is gone. We've crossed that line and there's no going back. So if you want to try Higgsville and experience Veo 3.1 yourself, I'll drop the link in the description. And if this video helped you discover something new, hit that like button and subscribe. Because AI moves fast and I'm breaking down every AI tool worth your attention. See you in the next one.